Hello everybody, this is Goofs and Fox coming at you with a match here in the Rigazi Custom. This is going to be a 700 cost match here on Colony Drop Area. And I did mean to have this match ready for uh, last Wednesday, but then I got that match with the Gym Sniper 3 and Gym Sniper 3 was a suit I've really been wanting to get a match of for a while, so I did prioritize that one over this one. Also, that one was a space match, so it was a bit more unique than a lot of the recent more ground matches that I've had, so I do have this 700 cost match here with the Rig Z Custom, finally getting this one out, and this was like a week that I just really wanted to play the Rig Z Custom, which is weird because I don't really tend to play this suit. It's not that I think the suit is bad or anything, but it's not just one that I'm personally uh, really that good at using, uh, at least at its native cost, but at 700 here, which is where I was mostly, like, trying it out, I was actually able to get some really good matches with it, so, uh, quite impressed with my performance here using this, but, I also did want to use this color scheme here, which is the Tristan color scheme, but for the back section, I try to make it look like a separate attached, like, flight system or something, I just trying to do a, you know, kind of the things I've been doing, just trying to make a more unique color scheme instead of the typical blue and black that I'm pretty sure everyone has seen me use at least one time or another. And this is also an ace match, so yeah, lots of stuff to cover here, and well, I just got um, disabled by the FF new there. So the enemy team does have a pretty decent lead at the moment, but... Uh, soon I'll be able to spawn back in, and by soon I mean right now. And let's see, the rest of our team, minus player 4, they look like they're all almost full health at the moment, so gonna try to see what I can do to help. Did get heavy staggered by the, looks like the same FF new from earlier, but I do have a bit of a ranged advantage here that I can work with. And since now we want to spawn in, for the rest of the team here, we do have a Nightingale, a Palace Athene, a high new Gundam and a Phoenix, so pretty nice team set up there. Uh, probably the Palace Athene and me here in the Rigsy Custom are probably the uh, more weird things here for 700. Although I'm pretty sure I've seen the Palace Athene, but I don't know if I've ever seen the Rigsy Custom really used at 700. And do really actually like you? I said it earlier. I do like using the suit at this cost. At its native cost, like 600, I'm not really that fond of using it, but yeah, something about it using it at 700, I don't know if it's just because it's a different suit than, uh, you know, a lot of these 700 offerings, so maybe it's just, you know, playing something different kind of just felt a bit more refreshing than uh, what I usually play, because at 700, Typically, I only play the new Gundam, so I don't really have that many options when it comes to 700 suits. I don't have that many, and I have less of them that I'm actually good at using, so kind of just tend to stay away from, like, any other options that I could be playing, but uh, this time I decided to try something different, and again, went a lot better than I thought it was going to. Good thing about having flight here is that I'm going to be able to quickly pull back from the battlefield and try to fly in here, see if I can hit whoever this is. Looks like it is a regular new Gundam going to tackle, and good thing I was actually close enough to get some of the healing from the Phoenix, who I'm assuming just went into uh, Awoken. I assume that's when that, or at least I think that's when that buff comes in, when it does the uh, help to your teammates, so... Was very nice there, which means I think my biosensor just activated too, so when I get to low enough health again, then I'm going to get that back, so that's going to be very helpful in that instance. Hoping my Nightingale try to take out this enemy Ashimar here while it's just us. And while we have kind of the numerical advantage here, see if we can finish him off before going back to the rest of the team. Hit him with the downswing, and Nightingale looks like going to be the one who finishes him off there. Try to get him with the Vulcans, but not going to be quick enough, but hey, there we go. Aces are going to be selected soon, so we'll see who it is for this match here. I don't believe I get the Ace this match, but I think another match I did I actually did manage to get the Ace, but uh, it might be this one. I don't remember off the top of my head, so uh, it'll be a bit of a surprise here. 
I do see somebody is over here, I'm gonna try to pursue him. Looks like it is the FF Sazabi. Uh, they're gonna finish me off though, so... Oh, looks like it's the Nightingale, that is our ace, and the FF New, that is going to be the enemy ace, so... We know who's who there. There's our Nightingale, looks like they just finished off that FF Sazabi. So, very nice there. And looks like both the aces are at half health, so looks like we only point D as well. Uh, not a lot of point stealing going on here, but the team looks like they're very coordinated, so we should be pretty fine in trying to get those points, although our ace's health is dropping. Gonna try to fly in with the Mega Beam Cannon here, see if I can hit somebody with it. Uh, not seeing anybody at the moment, there's somebody. Uh, looks like I'm going to uh, miss though, unfortunately. Gonna try to do the dodge and try to get with my teammates here. Don't want to get caught alone. And getting hit on the side here. That's the new Gundam that's trying to pursue me. Looks like our Phoenix is in their NCD mode. Not awoken yet, but uh, hopefully they will get there soon. There is a Sinaju. Looks like their uh, um, Psycho Frame is already activated, so gotta be careful. And gonna go in for the tackle. Did get the counter there, so gonna be able to kick him to the ground. And unfortunately, my downswing did miss there, and they have a very small fraction of their health there. And gonna see what I can do to finish them off. I think I'm gonna be able to finish them off here. Yep, luckily my B machine gun round was able to hit him, even though they did get a neutral swing on me, but uh, not as devastating as a downswing, and at least it wasn't the shield, which does instantly knock over with that weapon, so... Uh, not not the worst case scenario I could be in here. Going in for melee, trying to knock over the FF Sazabi here. And they are now low in health as well. Uh, I don't think our ace is going to come by quick enough, so I'm going to just get the finishing blow there. Add 700 points to our score count. And flying over to help out here, looks like the enemy ace has spawned back in. I'm uh, gonna fly underneath here because I do see that there are some enemies over there, and again, really do not want to get caught alone in this suit. I was more or less trying to be a bit more supportive, kind of staying in the back and going in for melee if I possibly could. Uh, pretty much the standard, I feel like, playstyle that I tend to go with with a lot of these suits, to so stay in the back, uh, poke at damage with people, and then... If I can go in for melee, then I typically will, especially if it is a uh, suit with some decent melee. And hey, you did get the destruction assist there on what looked like the FF New. And hey, was able to get a counter there on the Sazabi. And looks like I was able to get the assist on them as well. I think the Phoenix may have gotten them, but uh, that's going to be a death for me there last minute, but... Time out, mission over, we got good works, we got a fine battle, and hey, that was fun in there. And mission completed. Let's see how we did here with the Rigazi Custom. And hey, gonna praise the Nightingale and the Palace of Fiend, because both did really well this match. Fifth place overall with four kills and three loss. Uh, third in pursuit assist, not too shabby there. And that's going to do it for this match here in the Rigazi Custom at 700. Again, really fun suit to use at this higher cost for me. It tends to be kind of a thing at 700, because it reminds me of the old DJ at 700 video I did. So, I think at 700 it's just, again, like, there's so... I have, like, so many limited options that I kind of like to take the opportunity to play something that is a bit different than what I usually do. Again, because I only play the new Gundam, so... Yeah, not, yeah, it's nice to just kind of switch things up every once in a while, but that's going to do it for this match here. Comment down below what you think about the Rigazi Custom. Remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and with that, I will see you all in the next one. Later.